Welcome back to Surviving Mars. And today our main goal is to bring more people into the planet because we do have a lot of empty residential slots. We do have a lot of jobs available and we are making good use of all of that. So this is the main goal. Uh, and we are starting by bringing this rocket in here, as you can see. And hopefully we can see some people getting out. There we go. As soon as we're ready, we'll send this back. And then we... I don't think I, I have any other... Yeah, I don't have other rockets. We could buy a new one. That will cost me 3 million. And you know what? I think we'll need that. We just have one at the moment. And then we'll go straight into there. And we don't have enough people. Ooh. But I'll make good use of that rocket because I'll need this one to go around and do some things in here. So if you look at planetary view, I want to import some greenhouse gases because this will give me 2% more atmosphere. And yeah, and 1% more temperature. This will cost me some money this will cost me some fuel which is like money is a little bit hard right now but it's fine uh, the other option would be i think this one but then we will lose the the rocket i don't want that this will just give water which i might send that next so let's go with this one first send expedition hopefully everything will be fine and we'll see, we still have like some food in here. We, yeah, we will be all right. And then we wait a little bit and I bring a rocket full of people. Just wait until the next soul and see what happens. Got our new colonists in there, that's fine. And then we are potentially, yeah, as you can see, we have a lot of bushes and grass and Okay, and it's looking really good. I just would love that the quality in here would be a little bit better when you're looking from far away, because from close by, it's okay. When you look from far away, it just feels like everything is broken, but it's not actually. So yeah, why do we have three people jobless? Uh, you are a botanist. Two people, I think they are still finding jobs at the moment which is fine give them some time and we'll figure it out we also need more vegetation and that's why we start doing like the the bushes and all that stuff and if i remember correctly i should have this one here yeah for station so what are we doing or what we should be doing is listen and the idea for that is because we need to make the land around us a little bit more rich. The soil needs to be richer. And then we go we go with things like... Oh, I love this one as well. Um, maybe go with trees. And then the final one will be hopefully grass. There you go. So we can rotate that we do have another one in here but the soil again is not great although we have an area in here and with this lake around here i think this will start getting better but yeah it's the same rotation lichen grass and trees and these will hopefully um grass also helps the soil quality by the way just lichen that increases that a lot more and oh actually plant increase it uh quite a lot uh, the, the trees I haven't noticed that so that's good to know we are doing trees over here as well just make sure that we have that everywhere and trees and bushes all right what is the other one yeah we have another one in here we are doing that and finally in this area we well i selected the wrong thing in there what is it? Here. Just hit that. All right, we're doing some trees and grass. So, always well. We are having some progress. 
our shuttle is going out to increase your atmosphere so that's good but the idea is that we get maximum pressure so we get the uh, air breathable so we don't need like domes or pressure suits that's the idea so that's going well we are at the moment yeah this is okay we do have seeds that's increasing that's fantastic actually and i'm thinking about doing even more with the forestation plants especially around here as we we do have this area for for the lake i mean so what i could do is a bit of an overlapping in there complete. then we need power so fusion auto regulation what was that again um fusion reactor upgrades reduce the amount of workers we can use that but yeah i want this one this is there now oh, a capital city would be nice what does it do it decreases the loss of atmosphere i think we have one of that right yeah we have one of that in there which is actually good but power electricity we go from here i could hook it up over the air to be honest like so yeah that'll be too easy pretty fast and maybe i'll do different on this one let's see how this goes oh look at this it's starting to get some lichen in here that's fantastic and what I think we need, yeah, it's bringing the um, seeds. That's what I'm looking for. And we should have enough. Good. And working. Yay. We're still having like those mysterious mirages. So how are we doing? Or special project is almost done can we bring more people from earth now passenger we can let's launch our filters are remaining the same i at least at the moment i won't change that uh we have enough waste rock we have enough concrete our machine parts is actually getting better at the moment polymers is also good fuel is also good at the moment and electronics is oh good so in terms of resource i think we are fine food we have enough um metals we do have we are okay we are producing more than we are consuming so that's fine we are storing oxygen we have enough water is the same and demand is also enough um yeah we shouldn't be shouldn't have any problem only concern now is actually electricity because i do think we could have more if i look at power i could do another fusion reactor it would be three electronics for maintenance but i think this might be good for us it produces 200 which is like fantastic and to be honest i think we can hook this up to this grid that would be all right actually the fusion reactor i believe we need people for that don't we i can also upgrade that oh we i I'm pretty sure that we have enough. Uh, not enough. <laughs> we have enough, but uh, I'm pretty sure that we have another one. I just don't remember where we've put that. What? Is that the one? Yes, that's the one. Let's upgrade. Oh, that's a lot of people working here. I definitely want this upgraded. At the moment, we have three, six, eight times three. One per shift. 
so that's quite a lot which is basically the same in here let's upgrade that one as well and make sure that we we have enough in terms of stored power we still have yeah we still have like a lot of capacity but i could add more storage capacity in here as well an atomic accumulator i could do this we don't have one in there but i, I want you to do another one go cool, let's see we went from eight to six per turn which is huge difference and yes that's much better good uh view greenhouse gases just a few of the falling rocks delivered by autonomous crafts on earth were visible to the naked eye but a large scale project has been completed today several hundred tons of rocks used to suck out and store greenhouse gases from the atmosphere on earth have been delivered to the surface of mars by crash landing them all over the planet, we have triggered a chemical reaction that solves the rocks and contributes towards thickening the Martian atmosphere by unleashing the stored gases. Yes. And we have a new project, which is basically the same one, because we can keep repeating that. But I want to increase this one now, get a little bit more water. We need fuel and some machines. Let's do that. Oh, we are not there yet. So you can land. We have people in there. And then I think I can send you as soon as you land. Let's greet everyone. Yay! Welcome, everyone. Nice. And you can all work in here. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> and in there. Now we hopefully have enough power in there. And I want to see if we're storing everything. But definitely we go back in here and we send an expedition. There we go. Send it. And we should be good. So thank you for that. You can go away. And how are we with this? Well, 12 hours is a lot better already. I want to see if we need more power storage or if what we have is more than enough. Hopefully we don't need more. Look at how busy these drones are. Like they are doing an awesome job. Perfect. Cool. We have another shuttle that we can land. We'll land it over there, which is the one that completed our mission over there. We're not losing any atmosphere, so that's great. Can we get... Maybe if we build more of those, we could... This will actually get us more temperature, not atmosphere. Do we have any other building that we can use for that? Uh, let me see. We have... Terraform. This one, well, this gets me the forestation. This is water. This is food. And yeah, this is just, um, oh, this one, carbonate processor. This will use waste rock. You know what? That might be a good idea. I know that we have these. Yeah, we have one of these in here. We don't need anyone doing that. It does consume 50 power though, which is maybe the problem there and why I might be not willing to do that right now. Maybe we wait a little bit. Uh, this we are using... Yeah, we are using quite a lot. I think we need more fuel. So what do we need for fuel again? Fuel refinery. Well, we can definitely have that. Consumes power and water. I know that we have one over here. It's probably, it's about time we build one on this side. So we have like things closer. And to be honest, ooh, sanity breakdown. Hello, darkness, my old friends. 
Aconis has snapped and after regaining consciousness has plunged into the deepest depression. Mercedes Warren couldn't bear any responsibility anymore and lost the motivation to go on. Their co-workers fear that their colleague could make some irreparable mistakes. So is unable to work. Uh, I would suggest seeking professional help. Let's do it. A known outcome, but I think that's potentially the best outcome there. And then we hook this up for some more fuel. I think we have like place to store fuel in there, so that'll be alright. And yeah, we are we are doing well in terms of stored capacity. 22, we could do we have more capacity for storing power. That's uh, what means 20 2000 now out of 38 so it's all right but hopefully this is is slightly better now where is you producing power in there yeah not anymore so 23000 was the the total um, power demand is a thousand and it lasts for 21 hours which is more than enough for overnight so hopefully we will get that uh, increased in value. If we look at this shuttle, we do have everything loaded. So let's send that back to Earth. We can bring more people in. And that is blood music, meta phase. Let's see. More colonies have been completely rewritten. Again, they have lost all of their personality and have become more or less the same perfect individual. Five clones have lost their traits and have gained the perks composed, fit, and sexy. All right. That's all we need. <laughs> all the skills you need to survive on Mars. What could go wrong? Oh, we have quite a lot of seeds now. I might do more of those. How much power we consume? Consume 10 of those. But you know what? I think that will make sense adding more and more to it. Why can we add more? Just looking around, maybe around here somewhere, feels like a good place. We already have an area that might be enough for us, so let's do it. Let's hook that up as well, get some power cables. And do we have any seeds in here? I don't think we use this for anything, to be honest. I might even remove that. Oh, it consumes one power. I think that's okay. No need to, to panic for that. And this is close enough for everyone, so they'll be all right there. They'll be able to build it and to start working on that. Renegades, yeah, it's all right. And I love this building over here. I think this looks quite cool. How are we doing now? 24, 25, all right, starting to go up again. Perfect. And we just need one more electronic in here and we should be fine. So, just making sure your consumption is 34 at the moment. Just wait this to be constructed and I'll take a look at that. So let's go with grass, bushes and trees. Once you start increasing the vegetation as well, I think that will help us. All right, how are we doing with this fuel? We can potentially upgrade production. Yep. Yeah. And amplify. 10% consumption of power. You know what? For the moment, I won't do that. Let's just see how that goes. We are up to 48 production with 28 uh, consumption. So it's good. We we'll balance things out easily. But now we ate through our fuel reserves. 
but our rocket is back in on Earth and we have people, so let's launch more people in. How are we doing here? We have 177 Martian born now, which is awesome. That's a lot more than I expected in the past. And average morale is actually quite low. Comfort we could do with shopping and social and luxury and gaming. What about this one? Social. And what about this one? Social. Yeah, seems like a trend. <laughs> and which buildings will give us social? Exercise and social. This actually gives luxury, gaming, gambling and social. We may do a casino over here. We have one over there. So I don't want you to do another one. You can go for something else that gives social. Maybe a gym or Logi Amusement Park. Service Comfort 60. Wow. This gives medical checks, dining, social and food. What do we have? One of those. Oh, we don't have it in here. I think we have it in there. Yeah. I'll build this around here. And then we have space for something else in there. What is it complaining about being low? Machine parts. Ooh. Why are we so low in machine? Because we're not producing enough. Maybe we should increase production even at the cost of power. That might be something that we do. I, I think I'll do that. Or maybe we wait more people to arrive because then they will work in there. Let's see. We'll bring more people in here and see if they go work in there and start helping. Um, storage is full as well, which is interesting. Store metals. Store machine parts. New colonists have arrived. We might need more shuttles. That's what I'm looking at. Let's take a look at that. So oh we have this MDS laser to, to add as well. Shuttle hub. Would this give me more? I never remember if they give you more or just I'll, I'll add one more, that's fine. Let's get you somewhere in here. Can fit you there, and that's where you go. Yeah, shuttle hub. Oh, we can construct shuttles as well. Oh, that's interesting. Yes. Although we'll like use a lot of resources for this. Oh, and global load is actually heavy. Hmm, yeah, we, we need more of those. Let's build this up and then we can take a look at the transportation problem. I, I haven't realized that this was a problem. I was thinking that was a drone problem, not a shadow problem. I might add like one or two more around here. Maybe we just align these with the solar panels in there. How is this coming? Well, we need more polymers and electronics, but hopefully it's going all right. We have more people working in here, so it should be better, I hope. We are, yeah, we are producing more than we are consuming, so there we go. That's what we want to see over there. The bringing, obviously, will take a little bit longer because the workload is heavy, as they say over here. We have five shuttles in there. We can have 12. Hmm, that's interesting. So I could build 
just build more. Like this. Oh, look at how many polymers we need for that. Yeah, I... I'll wait. <laughs> so, oh, Marsquake. Four buildings damaged. We'll have some work to do. But we completed the ice asteroids. Um, which is fantastic. We then have another option in there. Which is alright. And but we increase to 21%, almost 22% our atmosphere. Which, you know, we can't complain about it. And as soon as we have our shuttle back, I might uh, send it back. Although, we could send this straight away into another mission. The problem with that is money. How much money do we have? 1.5. I'll hold on that. I would love to do that one that we lose the, the shuttle though. This one. The problem is that it's so expensive, but look at that. So worth it. 10% water, 5% atmosphere. I'll, I'll wait a little bit before we do that. I'll probably just send this back to, to Earth. We have all our exports in here. Let's send that back so we can bring in even more people. And oh, this area is starting to look better and better. Nice. What I also think that we could do here, we could hopefully, I'll try to level this area and build another lake in here. Let's see what we can do. Terraform, flatten terrain, and RNT to resize. All right, let's look at these this way and then I'll try there. Because this will definitely be where we build a new lake. And maybe we flatten this area as well. I don't know if we need to. I just want areas in that we can make like greener and greener. If I look at these again, like in here, I could actually make this a nice flat area. Uh, this one, I'll put you in there. How's your workload now? Low. Nice. That's what I want to see. Can get that out of the way and then we look at and should we cover this hmm i think i will level this up as well well not in here uh flatten and we go from here all the way Hopefully this works. That we need like a lot of waste rock. It requires 52. We have that. This actually has waste rock and quite a lot. <laughs> a lot more than what we're putting in here. So I think we'll be good. And we should be then ready to go. So what is this shuttle? It's waiting in here. Got some funding, fantastic. We could then send another expedition. And we could use that one that actually uses a little bit of money. So we get more atmosphere. And there we go. There we go. And send. And I just noticed that we reached 5% vegetation. This is starting to become what I think it should become. Good. Just to finalize things in here, I think what I'll do is basically get in here and add a connection to this one. Where is the limit in there? There and here. Okay, there'll be this one over here. 
and yeah we have one in that in that area but what i'm thinking we have like a, a gap in here although we could um reduce show effect range but actually oh, we have like a big gap in here that i might wait to do that then or i could go i could go here actually let's do it do we have an electrical connection in here or cables do we need doesn't seem like we need it we do need one for that one where do we go for a power connection there might go all the way here oh there we go now we can see what's going on around here it's weird that i can see any bushes or trees in there don't know why maybe i should replace this one and get you some bushes this one we can also change that milestone achieved oh we achieved plant a tree on the surface of mars oh we have a tree what is our tree hold on we have to find it <laughs> uh i can't see it where's our tree i know that we have a tree show me i can't find it maybe if you find it let me know in the comments because i certainly can't see where that is like I, i'm looking pretty hard at the moment and i can't for the life of me see where that is um hmm, interesting maybe it hasn't grown yet we just planted it that might be what happened I, I don't know i really don't know so this one is done good this one is working as well so let's change that for three this is grass this is bush and this area is flat so we can look at a lake I want a huge lake in here. Well, that's far from working drone commander. I can work around that. That's not a problem. Uh, what we can do as well is bring some power cables from here to there. And we also need some pipes, I believe. Let's look at getting life support pipes and then we connect these interesting enough i can go over the building there i can potentially connect it through here through there and connect over there good foreigner in a foreign land one of our sponsor satellites have made some believable photos of the surface of mars some of them a naked boy can be seen currently jumping around and placing and playing on the very surface of mars there is no oxygen max masks in view nor any protection from the impossible martian code physicists are baffled and wildly speculate about optical illusions atmospheric anomalies and all kind of quantum physics mumbo jumbo the truth is we can never know what this is until we send an expedition all right uh that'll be an interesting title for the video the naked boy <laughs> i have to take a look at that what is that here lost child send five medic fortunately we don't have yet we have to wait this rocket to to come back but we'll certainly take a look at that in the next episode. For now, well, just 
I know that I usually say one more three, but it's just one more. One more terraforming. Just over here. So we can connect things in here as well. And then I'll definitely do another lake in here. Oh, well, that's uneven as well. So let's make it even. But this time I want to make it a little bit larger. Yeah, there we go. Because then we can put a lake down in here somewhere and we can see what happens with this area. Although we might be able to put something in here. Let's see. Uh, lake, large lake. Over there would be fine. And then we just complete things with like power cables and whatever else that we might need. So this one connects over there. And then pipes, pipes, we need pipes. Let's get this one in here. These will connect over here with the rest of the, the pipes we have. Cool. They obviously won't build it yet. Uh, and we finish the core heat convector. Improves temperature of Mars gradually and consumes water. That's fine. For now, I think we are okay in terms of temperature. We don't actually need that. We need more atmosphere. And I'll see if I can get these lakes building in between episodes so for now thanks a lot for all your help all your suggestions all your comments and likes and maybe take a look at the video on your screen i think you might like that and i'll see you in the next one bye bye